it was chaos because my dad was an alcoholic. Um, and um, I would watch my mom get beat because he wouldn't be allowed to drive. And so um, fast forward to whenever I was 15, my dad actually tried to commit suicide. He cut his wrists and said that um, uh, he wasn't strong enough to break the generational curses. Um, mm. And so with that being said, we took him, we, he cut his wrist, we called 911, got him in the hospital. And uh, 30 days later, he was successful in actually killing himself. Um, and um, I watched my mom like slowly um, die after that, um, where I started looking for the love that he, you know, left. Me Head not east on um, Lemoyne Street towards Sunset I ended up having my first child when I was 16, and then my second child when I was 19. Um, and my mom was great. She helped me. She was my best friend, you know, and um, she just missed him. And then, you know, fast forward to 2010, I had my son. And um, 2012, actually, I lost custody because um, I had told my ex-husband um, about how I was using drugs, and he used that against me, so I stopped trusting people. Um, and then my mom started using drugs with me, so, um, sorry. <laughs> um, two fentanyl pills. Um, I took one, my mom took one, and she overdosed. Um, and my daughter, who's amazing, she, bless her heart, she found my mom. And I turned to drugs, and Emily turned to uh, Christianity. And so, <laughs> yes, um, so, the way God works is in Tennessee, there was a lady who uh, Kate, she had graduated from the DCLS program, became Emily's, basically her sponsor, was telling Emily all about the program, and Emily had gotten um, a bunch of scholarships, a bunch of schools wanted her, and she came to me one day and she said, you know, Mom, um, God's calling me to California, and I said it was a cult, no offense, it's not, I love this cult, um, <laughs> I love it, but no, so Emily ended up coming out here in June, Last year, I came to her graduation, and she introduced me to everybody, and she was like, Emily, or Emily, Emily's like, Mom, just stay, you can have friends, I mean, you'll love it, it'll be great, and I said, Emily, the only way I'm staying here is if I lose my job and I lose my house, but if anybody knows that if God wants you somewhere, if you speak something, here I am. <laughs> Family, people without family in with family members, and those are my girls up there. I 